guys, it's Sarah and I'm here with another Disney layout. This one's going to be a little bit different. It's not going to be a 12 by 12. This is going to be a pocketed page that I'm going to stick into my album. And this is going to be um, right where all the princesses are. And these are just extra pictures from the day of meeting all the princesses. So kind of like our little extras. They're not the fancy ones. They're, you know, the girls are talking to them or they're giving hugs or something. So I'm taking a um, Project Life page protector and I'm just going to add these in there. Okay, so I'm using this wood veneer that says Dream Today and I use some Hero Arts Pink Neon ink dauber and I inked it up and as you could tell it was very, very bright. It inked up beautifully so I was really happy with that. So I'm going to let that dry while I work on the rest of these things. So I just pulled a bunch of stuff that can go with princesses <laughs> and um, most of it is simple stories from their Enchanted line which is not technically Disney princess but it is very princessy. And then um, I had that little piece of paper that had a bunch of princesses and I was able to cut it down to a 4x4 four four, no problem. So I went ahead and stuck that towards the bottom and that's from an actual Disney paper pack. And then I have all these pictures that I printed. I think I printed at least eight different pictures of just, you know, um, them signing the autograph books and just not the ones that I actually put on the layout, the 12 by 12 layouts. So I'm trying to figure out exactly where I want everything to go. And as you can see, this page protector, it's the side or the design J. So it has four or three four by fours on the outside and then three three by fours on the inside. <laughs> I hope I said that right. Um, so I printed all my pictures four by four because I knew that a bunch of them I could just cut down to a three by four. I could just cut out some of the excess of the um, pictures there. So I just went ahead and did that just to make it a little bit easier on myself. <laughs> And I have uh, just a couple random things. I have a couple tags there that I'm going to use. And um, we're going to see how it goes. So I have these little circles that have little silver embossed or silver foil hearts on them. I'm going to end up using both of those on these little extra pieces here. One is purple and one is blue. And the purple one I actually put on off camera because I've lost track of it and I found it as I was cleaning up so I stuck it on but you'll see those in the close-ups and I'm just trying to see what else I want to use here so I'm gonna I'm looking at this bell one that has the little photo card the photo pass card and I'm gonna cut down this little piece of paper to a three by four I'm gonna put down our photo pass card and those are um, from the actual event that we went to with Belle and they took pictures for us so we could you know purchase them later if we wanted to. They ended up being really expensive and I was like nope what we have is fine. So I didn't actually purchase the pictures but we got to see them <laughs> and I just kept the card that had our numbers our photo numbers on the back there. Um, so I have this washi tape that is Disney Princess washi tape and I got that at Joanne quite a while ago. I got it for my sister or for my sister for my daughter and I steal it every so often, but it just has the little portraits of the, the princesses. And then I put the blue heart on there and this little banner that says Enchanted. I kind of stuck that over the photo pass words, you know, don't really need them. And then I'm going to use a little phrase sticker that says Once Upon a Time. No, Wish Upon a Star, sorry. It says Wish Upon a Star, so I'm just going to stick that there too. I'm just trying to embellish it up a little bit, nothing too crazy. All right, so I'm printing, I'm cutting down some of my pictures there. So, um, and then I'm gonna go ahead and check my dream today, and that is dry. So I'm gonna go ahead and work on that. I have this cut apart sheet here from Simple Stories. From there, this is from the Enchanted line. So I'm gonna cut out a little four by four square and kind of use this as my title. And it has that little nice printed banner on top already. So I really like that. And I'm gonna um, glue down that wood veneer onto that and that's going to be kind of my title square. And I'm just looking to see if there's anything else I want to cut out, but everything's a little bit too big, so I'm not going to do that. I'm going to go ahead and put this down. And like I said, that ink, that ink dauber I've had for at least two years, maybe even three, and it just inked beautifully still. I was really impressed. <laughs> Sometimes ink can start kind of drying up or separating or whatever, but it actually really uh, turned out nicely, so I was really happy with that. 
And, you know, I'm watching Vikings while I'm making this, and, oh, man. Oh. Rip my heart out. If you watch it and you're caught up, you probably know what I'm talking about, but my heart got ripped to shreds. I was so upset. Oh, my gosh. Okay. I'll stop now. Um, okay, so I have this stamp from um, Allie Edwards, and it's a magic themed, and I put magic happens, and I stamped that right above the dream today. So I'm going to have that there. And what else am I going to do to that? I know I do something else. Oh, yes, I add this little crown from the Enchanted sticker sheet. And then I think that I'm going to let that be it. That's going to stand as it is. And I'm having to cut down these pictures a little bit, um, especially with the Becky Higgins. You kind of have to cut them down a little bit than what it actually says the size is because it has a hard time um, getting them in. <laughs> All right. And so for the Cinderella, I cut it down to a three by four. And I'm going to just put this little um, shoe sticker up on top, like a slipper. And I'm going to put that in there and let that be there. And so, again, I'm just cutting these things down. There's Jasmine um, signing their books, and then Merida is giving them a hug. You know, she's talking to them, and then the second one, she's hugging them. And then Cinderella up at the top. You know, I have a great one of her looking, her and Kaylin are looking at each other while they're talking and giving them hugs and everything, and Rapunzel giving hugs and signing, and then Ariel signing, so... These are just kind of the extra stuff that did not make it onto the uh, formal layouts that I did. All right, so now I'm gonna cut down this piece of paper here and have this uh, be right there. And I have this gray tag and I'm gonna use that. That's from Studio Calico. And I'm gonna overlay it with this little piece of clothing tag actually, but it says Disney princesses and it has four of the three of the princesses that we met on there. And so it was kind of cool. <laughs> <laughs> to have that but that came from like a shirt or something I think that I got one of the girls and I keep that kind of stuff if there's a cute tag or something that I think I could use I keep those since I have girls and they like all the princesses and stuff I'm going to use more of this washi tape and I'm going to have a hard time getting it underneath the tag to the point where I take the tag off and then lay it down because it just will not go under correctly so I'm going to lay the washi down first and then stick the tag back on top of it And I'm not sure what else I do to that tag. It takes me a few minutes to figure out what I want to do. I am going to end up putting that purple circle on that tag somewhere, but um, I, like I said, I do that off camera, so you'll see that in the close-ups. But I'm just looking around and trying to see if there's anything that I can throw on here to help kind of finish it off. I don't really have any journaling to do. It's just the extra pictures, and you can kind of tell what they are, so I don't worry about anything like that. And let's see, what do I do? I, I guess I don't do anything else except I add the heart afterwards. Um, oh, I'm going to take Merida and I'm going to put this little Dreams Do Come True banner sticker on top of there. And I'm going to add one more thing down on the princess picture down below from the pattern paper. And it's a little tag that says, it's not easy being a princess. And um, it's not for them, let me tell you. <laughs> they have to smile all day and be nice to everybody all day, and I'm sure that's really hard. So bless them. <laughs> um, so I put that sticker on this little um, file tab almost, and I'm just going to cut this down a little bit, and it has a nice little pattern on it. So I'm just going to stick that right over the bottom of the princess paper there and just kind of let that be there. And I really like the way that that looks. So that is going to be it. So I'm going to stick this into my album behind all of my official uh, princess layouts. And it's going to look really nice. And I hope you enjoyed it. I have a bunch of close-ups here for you. And um, as you can see, there's that purple heart on that tag up above there. Hope you guys have a great day. And I will see you guys again soon. Bye.